last night not all the animals we had boomer bootsy and freckles <laughs> mama and mojo were hiding all night so they may come out today well mojo may had this sweet pit bull here yesterday that everybody was afraid of <laughs> including you including me not me she was so sweet she was licking my face well, she was licking my face. I thought she was tasting me for to see if she was gonna <laughs> like me later. You're just a big baby. <laughs> you put put pit bulls into that category. And then, well, I just went into the kitchen, and saw her sitting there, and I smiled at her. You had a hat her. on. You had a hat on. That's what I was told. Yes. The hat thing, but yes, most dogs do not like hats. That's what it is. All right. What Boomer it was is. like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, and Freckles was like, yeah, whatever too. But Penny was saying, "Will that fit in my mouth?" <laughs> No. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Penny was a sweetheart. She was such a cute dog. Really, really cute. I love pit bulls. I love all dogs. They're, I love animals. So. All right, Freckles. Freckles, is there food falling on the floor? <laughs> Not yet. Well. We'll see. I didn't sleep again last night. Restless leg syndrome. Yay! Let's party. I'm gonna eat my eggs and ham now. So I came to Habitat for Humanity here in Riverside with my mom and we're gonna ask to see if they'll let us uh, videotape a little inside. We'll see what we can come up with for flooring. Okay, so um, there's some things here that are, is nice to know that exist. I could probably, if I need something like these turns on the stairs because I, I know I'm going to be doing this eventually. I might be able to pick up some pieces like this pretty inexpensively. And the medallions for uh, for the uh, door, and some crown, and all kinds of uh, trim. It's nice to know, and a, a full run of a uh, stair and windows. This for this window, double glazed. Is two hundred dollars. So if I wanted to replace Megan's windows, this is probably the place to come. Yeah. It looks like pain? they're all double pane. Oh wow! Yeah, I, I paid six hundred dollars for this living window. Yeah. Well, that was just two hundred dollars for that full one. Um, the possibility of finding the exact size is probably not going to happen, but I know how to four by change eight. that. Most of those windows. Yeah. So this is where I need to come for doors and uh, screen doors. Definitely need a new screen door upstairs. <coughs> well, they got some beautiful tra uh, travertine, bullnose pavers, and steps, but nothing for kitchen floor, which is what we were hoping to get. Um, yeah, this finishing up the uh, outside. I'm might be uh, worth getting up, going after these. There's a whole pallet for 150 bucks. So Kevin was out all day and he brought me home my war wonton soup. So I'm having soup. And what did you get, baby? Since um, I'm tired of not getting having any chicken in my Kung Pao chicken, I got mushroom chicken. Mmm. Much better. Yeah, there's no way they can cheat you on that. 
Of course, if they could, I'm sure they'd figure it out. <laughs> Hello, neighbors. We are right now Skyping with Taylor Barry and Madison Ferretti, who are two of our fellow community members. And they're going to say a little hi to you guys. Hi. Madison, say hi so everyone can hear you. <laughs> <laughs> She's got an awesome channel, guys. You guys should really go check her out. Look up, Madison. Show us those beautiful blue eyes. Madison, show me your pretty blue eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. And there's Taylor, Taylor Barry. You have a channel too, Taylor, don't you? I, I'm planning to get a channel uh, soon. I want to start doing what you guys do. And I want to make a gaming channel for like The Sims 4 because I really like doing Sims 4 stuff. And she loves playing The Sims too. I got her into that when she was really young. Well, I know a couple of people that do The Sims games, and uh, you could definitely hook up with them and, and share, you know, play games back and forth. Yeah. Um, I want you guys to say goodbye to the neighborhood community. Get in there, Madison. Bye. <laughs> Hello. Everybody, <laughs> it's time for neighborhood community shoutouts. Hi, how are Hello, you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Fine. Do your thing. <laughs> okay, it's time for <clears throat> shoutouts. Unfortunately, we're going to start out with another sad one. Um, I spoke to you all yesterday about Glittering the Sky and her dog Gracie. Um, they had found a lot of tumors and they had only given her a few weeks left to live and that they were going to give her some medication to make it as painful or as painless as possible. Unfortunately, on Friday the 13th, Gracie passed away. So if we can all keep Natalia and her husband and their other dog, Heidi, in our thoughts and prayers and send wishes to Gracie, uh, we would all greatly appreciate that. Natalia, our hearts, you are in our hearts and our thoughts. Um, another one, um, needing positive uh, thoughts and prayers is Rex25059. Um, he got stabbed in the eye um, with a chopstick today and was in the emergency room. As of right now, as far as I know, he is doing okay. We don't know to what extent any damages or anything is. He is home from the hospital <coughs> right now, but please keep him in your thoughts and prayers. Um, sending positive healing thoughts his way um, that he doesn't need any surgeries or anything like that. So if you can all do that, we would greatly appreciate that as well. Okay, Rose Cutler. Name kind of sounds familiar. Not sure. You always know when I'm not sure what I do. Welcome to the neighborhood. <clears throat> Betsy Wetsy. She said she would love to come to California, because my question yesterday to everybody, if you could go somewhere for one week, where would you go? And Betsy Wetsy said she would come to California because she would want to meet the neighbors, Nikki and John, the Presleys, but she would want to go and spend time at the Queen Mary where her uncle spent most of his last months. And we would love for you to come out here, Betsy, and we would love to take you to the Queen Mary and spend time with you there talking about your uncle. Your uncle has been an inspiration of ours for years for and years. years and years. We uh, actually met, met your him uncle. On the Queen Mary. On the Queen Mary, and yeah. he's an amazing man, Betsy, and you're, you're very lucky to have him as a relative. So. Uh, Renee Carey, you are the only one who got the Carol reference from The Walking Dead in our vlog yesterday. Only one! At least the only one who mentioned it anyway. Don't know if other people got it, but yay for you, Renee Carey. Tina and Ralph Wood. 
Welcome to the neighborhood. And I'm not sure who it was. I, I think it was Tina that was typing the message. And if it was, her birthday <coughs> was Friday the 13th. And she doesn't like Friday the 13th. But happy belated birthday if it was you, Tina. If it's not you and if it was Ralph, happy belated birthday to you, Ralph. <coughs> Kelly Styles, welcome to the neighborhood. Some other places people said that they would like to go and visit for a week. We had a few say that they would like to come here to visit us. Like Lucy Owl, Portman Creek Diaries. Dana Beesaw said she wants to go to L.A. Um, we... would like to go to Ireland. But I would want to go for more... What? Stop blowing on me! I'm not doing anything! I would like to go for more than a week because mm -hmm. I want to explore many, many, many castles. So, my question for tonight is... We have... What did we count? 16? 15? 16, 15, 16, I don't know. We have 15 animals. How many animals do you all have? And if you don't have any, would you want an animal? Not that we're giving any of ours away. Daryl Roper, we're keeping Boomer. Um, Rocky, we're keeping Boomer. Um, but if you don't have any, would you like an animal? And what kind of animal would you like? I want one that feeds itself. <laughs> and can... Anyone out there name all 16 of our animals? Kind of interested to know if anybody can do that. Put your answers below. It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll. Okay. Trivia question from yesterday <laughs> came from The Ring, a movie based on a novel by Koji Suzuki. And the American version is the only one that actually had a ring in the movie. So, um, the question is, what was the significance of the ring? And what did it have to do with the plot? And the plot, of course, it, it, the reason is, from Koji, is that it's because of the cy cyclical nature of the plot. So that's the reasoning for the title. And those who got it was, first was Terry Johnson, second was Matt Yes. Was Greg Myers. Okay. And give an honorable mention. Oh, honorable attempt by uh, Mama. Mama's Vlog Zadie. Okay, today's uh, trivia question goes all the way back to 1976 and the Omen. Um, this is for you, Damien. Okay, so there's a scene where um, the Gregory Peck and uh, what's her name are in a car and then they're attacked by a baboon because they're driving to the Windsor Zoo. What did they do to get the baboons to attack the car? And it was not CGI. It was 1976. There you have it. Your trivia question for tonight, everybody. You are all... Don't shake your book at them. That's not nice. <laughs> He's not going to be allowed to have his own book anymore. I'm telling you, he's not capable. <laughs> you are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you out there. We love you all so very, very much. Thumbs up. Make sure to go by and check out the neighborhood zoo. <laughs> Paranormal investigations with the neighbors, PIN. <laughs> Megan's Arts and Crafts. And we will see you all tomorrow. Bye. Bye.